Okay, we're here at the uh, brand new library in the borough of Saint Laurent with uh, Mayor D'Souza, first of all, and Daniel Junot, uh, one of the library consultants for the English Montreal School Board. Mayor D'Souza, why don't you first tell us about this exciting arrangement you've made uh, or about to confirm, it hasn't been confirmed 100% yet, but in the planning stages with the uh, local schools, uh, borough and the city of Montreal. Well, we're very excited because it'll allow the kids in our community to have access to the libraries. We worked very hard with the English Montreal School Board, and we're glad that the schools are coming on board. Uh, for us, what's most important is this is a great library that we have, lots of good books, but we want people to use it. And so this, with this new agreement with the school board, uh, the students in Cedarcrest and Gardenview and Parkdale and Lauren Hill will be able to get library cards. They'll be able to have access to it. They'll be able to use it. Hopefully, they'll be able to have fun. So if this works out well, we think it augurs well, not just for Saint Laurent, but for the English Montreal School Board and the schools, not just limiting it to Saint Laurent, but hopefully in other communities as well. Okay, this library is brand new. Tell us a little bit about this library, what it's called and, and how it all came about. Well, this is an exciting library. It's uh, called La Bibliothèque du Boisé because it's right near the Marcel Laurent Woodlands. And so we've got a great view. You can come in and you can see the woods. You can see the birds, the bees, the butterflies as you sit here reading. Um, I think it's great because it's an environmentally friendly building. Uh, we hope to get lead gold, maybe even lead platinum status for this building. Um, it's great architectural design, but also it uses a lot of less energy, 60 plus, 60 percent less energy than a conventional building, and all of that heating comes from geothermal energy, meaning from the ground. So the carbon footprint is virtually minimal. But more than that, it's a great place. It's a very nice place. Lots of natural lighting coming in, uh, beautiful vistas looking onto the woods. The colors of the woods change all the time with the season. So, and once it's green, now we'd have the colors of autumn. So it's a very, very nice community library. And we've had a great reception from the community. Over 1,200 uh, users per day. And some days we've even gone as high as over 2,000 per day. Wow. Uh, en français, Daniel, you were the librarian at Garden View. Now you're at the, the head office. Uh, to tell us uh, what you think of this arrangement. Moi, je suis très heureuse de ce, je suis très heureuse de ce nouveau partenariat là. Euh, je trouve que ça va faire que les élèves de English Montreal School Board vont euh, profiter de cette belle ressource là qu'on a à Saint Laurent. Et en même temps, ça fait une belle complémentarité avec leur euh, bibliothèque scolaire qui est déjà bien garnie. Mais euh, pourquoi pas ajouter toutes les ressources et en faire euh, un beau partenariat. Merci beaucoup. We've got students from four schools here, Lauren Hill, Cedar Crest, Parkdale, and Garden View. And um, uh, we've got students, uh, your colleagues with you. First of all, why don't you introduce yourself and just tell me uh, what you think of this new library. Um, my name is Amal, and I really like this library. I think it's pretty nice that we could look out into like the woods and stuff while reading and doing our homework, and it's really calm, and I like it. And it's not a far walk from Lauren Hill, right? Eh? Not at all. It's all right. like five minutes to walk. Terrific. Now you're at Cedar Crest. Give a, tell us your name, please, and what grade you're in. Is Alexandra and I'm in grade five, and I find it like really nice and it's like it's big. Yeah, it's so big. Is yeah, it one of the biggest big. libraries you've seen? <laughs> yeah, probably. Yeah, and do you plan on using it? That's terrific. And what is your name? You're from which school? Uh, my name is Marcel from Parkdale, grade six. Okay. Um, I think this library is amazing. It's comfortable. Choose the books and it's big. Good for you. You like to read? Yeah. All right. And you don't just have to go on the internet. You can actually go get books, right? Yes. All right. That's great. And you're from Garden View. Can you give us your name? Uh, Sienna. I'm in grade five. And I really like this library because it's really pretty and big. And it has a lot of books. All right. So we'll have one last final word for the mayor. Uh, mayor D'Souza, what's the address? And, and there's another library that they also have access to. Tell us about that one. Well, we've got two libraries in Saint Laurent. One is the Bibliothèque du Boisé right here on Tivens Boulevard. But we've got a second library called the Bibliothèque du Vieux Saint Laurent. And that's in Saint Laurent on the corner of Saint Germain and uh, de l'Eglise. Both of the libraries work in complementarity. So people go, go use both libraries. Books deposited at one would be returned to the others. And I think it makes the li both libraries accessible to the community. One's in the east, the other one's in the west. So depending on where the students live, they can use any of the two libraries, and they can use and get access to the books in both libraries. I think it's uh, a great partnership. 
I think it should be good for the community. And I think if this partnership is implemented through all of the schools, all of the kids, I think we'll see it showing up in the love of learning, the desire to innovate, uh, the way to have fun. Uh, and these kids are going to be going to university one day, and they'll come back here and do their homework, do their projects over here. And I think we'll see it ultimately in our literacy rates, in our success rates in the schools in Saint Laurent and in the English Montreal School Board. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you.